Black Ant Powder, is this the missing element of your workout routine? Yes, black ant powder, and I mean consuming black ant powder, it might be the missing element of your workout routine offering to increase strength and decrease body fat. Hi, I'm Dr. Derek Alessi, the High Octane Dad, helping to unlock the superhuman potential inside every father. And when it comes to black ant powder, it's extremely interesting, and I've covered this before. So after an experience like that, why would I rush out to try it again? Well, the answer is I really liked how it made me feel. Yes, I did feel somewhat stronger, but what I liked more than anything else is I felt very energetic and extremely healthy. Polyrachis vicina. These ants live up high in the mountains and are often found among the ginseng roots. It's the premier qui tonic of Chinese herbalism. While ginseng is the most well known and the premier qui tonic by itself, black ant is known to be even stronger and more effective. The nutritional consistency of black ant is a good source of vitamins B1, B2, B12, D, and E. It's a complete protein source, 42 to 16 percent by mass, and contains all nine essential amino acids and 17 of the 22 total amino acids. It's a rich source of calcium, phosphorus, iron, manganese, selenium, zinc, and other trace minerals. In fact, it's considered by some the highest amount of zinc of any food. And it naturally contains ectosterone, which is interesting. Ectosterone is the growth hormone of insects, and it's what gives ants their unbelievable strength. I did some research. I did find some purported benefits of increasing strength in a muscle enhancer for rat and rodent studies, but I wasn't able to find anything in human studies. Okay, maybe I do have a little bit of a solution when it comes to the taste. In fact, we can make this bad taste taste a little bit better. So what I have decided to do is to mix the ant powder right here with the pre-pure workout drink to make sure that it's gonna taste better and I'm gonna get in the right things before my workout. Okay, here we go with the mixture. We have the pure pre-workout and I'm gonna mix it with in this bag is black ant powder. The serving size in here is a half to a full tablespoon. So we'll mix that in there. And the serving size of the pure pre-workout is same thing. Put a tablespoon in there and we're gonna mix it up with a little bit of water. And just to give you a little background of what's in the pre-pure workout drink, the ingredient lists are right here on the back. It's awfully tiny and small, I understand that. But in there is branch chain amino acids, including leucine, isoleucine, and valine. Creatine monohydrate to help the muscle tissue hold some water and have some more endurance. Some caffeine, some beetroot extract, green tea extract, bioperine, and stevia for a little bit of sweetener. Couple other things I do want to mention and shout out about the pure pre-workout drink is I did add creatine monohydrate there. It's been proven a lot recently to help control blood glucose level and a lot of research is being done with diabetics where initially it was all done with athletes. We could see how now it's working with the general population as well to keep blood sugar level low, especially during a workout. Also too in here, it is sweetened with stevia. I am not a fan of sucralose because I don't want to add any chlorine into my system. It's not good for the nervous system at all. And lastly with it, I wanted it to be beta aniline free. Beta aniline, and some of you may know this, is a non-essential amino acid and it can sometimes give you that 
itchiness or the rashiness or the hives that you might get some from some pre-workout drinks, which is not an overly pleasant experience. I didn't want the itchies, and I know a lot of my clientele doesn't want the itchies either, so I've kept it out of this to make sure it was something that was good for your body and also helps you for your workout. So now mixing with the pre-workout drink, a little bit down the hatch. It still tastes a smidgen like dirt. It made the pre-workout drink worse, it really did. Or you could think about it this way. The pre-workout drink made the black ant powder taste better. The black ant powder is tough to palate completely by itself, but when it's cut or mixed with the pre-pure workout drink, it's, it's easier to get down. Does black ant powder work? Well, the answer is maybe if you're doing the right things. In fact, what I like to tell a lot of people is nothing works in a vacuum. In fact, if you don't do your exercise, if you're not eating properly, you can't expect magic to happen just by eating more black ant. But if you are doing the right things, I think it could help your energy and increase your stamina, especially during the workout. What would that mean? Well, I think you have a better chance of developing more lean muscle tissue, having a faster metabolism, and dropping more body fat. So hopefully today this video serves you. Please remember to like and subscribe to the video down below because I want to keep making content that's important to you. Dr. Derek Alessi, the high-octane dad, helping to unlock the superhuman potential inside every father.